let's uh, take a look at some of the headlines that we have in the dailies. We'll start up with Vanguard, uh, the daily Vanguard here. And what we have here, kidnappers abduct pupils and teachers demand 30 million naira. <sighs> Worst in insecurity, that's what it says. This is sad. I wish, I wish. Uh. 4.6 billion ONSA funds shared to organize prayers against insecurity. Okay, that is uh, on the vanguard. Above the paper there that we can see there, AU expresses regret as uh, Mali, Burkina Faso, and Niger sent formal withdrawal notice to ECOWAS. New minimum wage negotiations will reckon with a situation in West Africa. Ayo Adebanjo and Oba Olaiton remain our leaders. This is coming from Afeni Fair. Uh, all of this on the front page of the Vanguard. Yeah, uh, I, I, I just don't want to. That part of that witness, I don't 4.6 billion share to organize prayer. I, I, okay, let's head over to the Guardian. And uh, the Guardian here, seven states on Niger borderline, bandits, smugglers, rain as sanctions and hardship ground communities that uh, uh, are just there beneath the flag. Uh, we can see Nigeria ranks 145 on graft index, scores 25 out of 100 points. Uh, workers demand living wage as FG unveils negotiation committee. Tuition fees hike imminent as private schools spend fortune on security. Again, Senate summons service chiefs over insecurity. Sign executive order on un unexplained wealth. Ndume tells Tinubu uh, all of this on the front page of The Guardian. And then we head over to The Punch. And we have here, abductors demand 100 million naira for equity school children and teachers. Police, NSCDC, uh, Amotekun, OPC, hunters from Joint Task Force arrest five suspects. Uh, NNPCL, uh, Wu, South Korean investors for gas projects, 300 stranded. Europe-bound Nigerians return from Libya. And uh, what do we see here? Adelik imposes curfew as two die in communal clash. Above the flag of the paper there, Naira plunges in official market. CBN warns forex trade, forex dealers. And Nigeria, IMF foresees weaker growth. And 200,000 Naira minimum wage no longer realistic. This is coming from labor. All of this on the front page of The Punch. Now let's head over to uh, the final paper that we have here is The Nation. The Nation has a killing of monarchs and abduction of pupils in equity draw outrage above uh, the flag there. Tinubu orders timely end to minimum wage talks. Article playing chip politics on national issues. This is presidency and ex-VP clash. 1.5 million in Benue IDP camps. Governor Alia laments Abuja disco management sacked over poor power supply. Uh, we can see here CBN pays $64 million airlines for its back, forex backlog. $700 million trapped, says IATA. Senators and reps seek urgent action against insecurity. And that's it. Uh, everybody's talking about insecurity, insecurity, insecurity. That's uh, the whole talk. Uh, it's quite a sad situation, quite a very, very sad situation. Um, something has to be done. This is just more than just a case of uh, having hope or being hopeful about it. It has to, something has to be done. I mean, we heard about the situation in Nikiti, quite very, very sad situation. Something needs to be done. We, uh, the, the, the National Assembly has summoned the security chiefs once again. Um, let's just hope it's not just a case of summoning and everything, you know, uh, we proceed as usual. Hopefully something is done quite this time. And that, that's it. That's all that we can take. Uh, that's all that we have on the headlines or the dailies this morning.